1924, the covered bridge was moved from Carl's Creek, some eight miles away, to this spot over the Rose Creek. It linked the workers in Watkinsville to their workplace at the Elder Mill. One of those workers was a young woman named Mary, some called her Molly Gollin. Mary Gollin fell in love with a man named Robert. Mary used to meet Robert nearby in a glade that locals now call the Haunted Wood. It was a popular place for picnics and country dances, that glade and this bridge. The young lovers used to come to these parties and dance until long after sunset. It was after one such dance that the accident happened. They were walking up the road just beyond the bridge when a car coming the other way surprised them. Mary was struck and carried beneath the car all the way onto the bridge. She died there before help could arrive. Perhaps if they had both been killed, their spirits could have gone on together, but Robert survived the collision. He went on to wed another girl, and his descendants still live here in Oconee County. Their name is Croft, and it was Robert's daughter, Marcia, who first heard the sounds of crying on the bridge. In fact, nearly half of all reported sightings have come from Robert's children and grandchildren. Though others have seen the ghost of Elder Mill Bridge, Mary Gollin seems most anxious to reveal herself to Robert's family, the family that should have been hers. Stay with me, won't you? In one hour, I will reveal what I have caught here tonight on this bridge.